So, good morning. It's a nice, uh, warm, sunny day here in the desert. It's already up to about 70. It's going to be uh, around there today. I'm going to do some laundry because I'm going to dump my tanks today. And since I'm going to be dumping my tanks and refilling my water anyway, why not get some laundry done with the water that I've got? Now, how am I going to do laundry in the desert? That's what you might be wondering. Well, it's going to take some water. All right, it's going to take about six gallons of water. There is a five gallon water tank that I'm filling up from the uh, drain valve on my main tank. And uh, yeah, that's about right for the first load. So let me stop that. And I'll show you how we're going to do laundry out in the desert. This is my washing machine. It costs about $100, $112, something like that. It draws about 70 watts on the AC, so I'll be running it off the inverter. That's the wash tub there, and at the bottom you can see the agitator that will spin in one direction and then spin in the other direction alternately to agitate the clothes. It works really well. This side, and I know there's wind noise, I apologize for that. I'll do my best to filter it out in post-production. It was calm until I started filming. <laughs> this side is the spin dryer. And uh, it does very well at getting the clothes down to just damp. And then uh, once they're done with the spin cycle, I've rigged a clothesline with a tripod and some paracord. <laughs> so <laughs> I'll be able to hang them up. And in the, uh, in the dry desert air, it should dry the clothes pretty quick. So uh, I've got bright sun on the panels. They can deliver 10 amps. I've calculated that this should draw, it's about 70 watts at 120 volts. So I should be able to run just off the energy coming from the panels. But even if I do hit the battery a little bit, so what? It's early in the day, it'll recover. So I'm going to get a load going and then I'll show it to you washing. So one thing I should definitely point out is I am using biodegradable laundry detergent. Okay, this stuff is made not to harm the environment. And because of that, I'll be able to drain my water right out onto the uh, right out onto the desert floor and just let it evaporate, which is what I plan to do. You can see the drain hose down there, and the ground slopes away towards a, a drainage ditch over there. So, for those of you that are worried about the environment, I'm using environmentally friendly biodegradable detergent, and it doesn't take much to wash the load of clothes. Hopefully you can see that down in there. It's spinning in one direction, pausing, and then spinning in the other direction. And it's going to run for about, uh, oh, seven or eight minutes on this load. And that's pretty much all my clothes. I just had a bunch of t-shirts and some uh, boxers, so, and socks. And then I might do another load with jeans and towels, but uh, we'll get these done. Just because I thought you guys might be curious, this is my battery voltage. And uh, it drops to 12.9 when it's running the motor. I can hear it. And when it stops, it starts to bounce back to 13.2. So it was starting at about 13.2. That's about where the panels have it up to so far this morning. We still don't have the direct overhead sun either. It's uh, still kind of low um, in the sky, so uh, you can see it bounces right back to 13.2. So the panels are, uh, are keeping up with the washer just fine. Now I can get almost that full load in the spinner at once, and you can hear it humming away. And the uh, clothes are going to come out of there just barely damp after a couple of minutes of spinning. So uh, that's, uh, that's pretty convenient. And I just drain the water out here on the ground. Like I said, eco-friendly, biodegradable detergent, so don't anybody go and try to slap my wrist here. I'm being conscious about it. So there you go. All I have to do when these are done is just hang them up and uh, about 15 minutes in this sunny, dry desert air, they'll be dry. These little washing machines are available all over Amazon. I suspect there's a generic Chinese manufacturer that manufactures them for several companies because they all look very similar. I'll put a link for the 
for one of these in the uh, video description below. Also, the laundry detergent. There's several brands of biodegradable detergent out there, and I'll put a link for the brand that I bought uh, in the description below if you're interested. So, there you go, how you can do laundry when you're camping. It's pretty convenient. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Also, if you're not already a subscriber, click to subscribe. Join us on the Facebook channel for discussion about the videos. And if you'd like to help support this channel, please click to support me on my Patreon page.